You guys, Rory is back. Okay, maybe he didn't actually go anywhere. He just didn't win for the first time in a month last week, but he was flying under the radar for the first couple rounds of the Deutsche Bank Championship. That was until he showed us on Sunday that he doesn't plan on going anywhere. McElroy fired off a bogey-free 7 under 64, throwing darts all day long that included this beautiful approach on the 15th. You can pretty much give him his sixth birdie of the day. And then a near ace on the very next hole. So another tap-in birdie here. McElroy enters Monday, just two off the lead. McElroy tied with Chris Kirk for the low round of the day. Both are at 10 under par, and it is projected that world number one will regain the FedEx Cup standings with a runner-up finish or better this week. Leading the way is Russell Henley, who carded a nice Sunday 65, including this 30-footer for birdie on the par 3 8. One off the lead is Billy Horschel, who needed a good finish this week, entering the second leg of the FedEx Cup playoffs in 82nd. He's now projected to improve to 11th in the standing, safely inside the top 70 that will move on to Denver come Monday evening. And speaking of that top 70, a lot can change with 18 holes to play, but right now, here are the projected bubble boys looking to advance to leg three of the playoffs. The last five in are Matt Jones, Jerry Kelly, Scott Langley, Henrik Stenson, and KJ Choi. Of course, all but Matt Jones are able to control their own destiny on Monday. And here are the projected first five out. Bo Van Pelt, Ryu Ishikawa, Justin Hicks, Jeff Ogilvy, and Stuart Sink. You know I love showing you the must-see shots here on The Takeaway, but how about the must-hear? Take a listen to the conversation that goes on behind the scenes between Phil and Bones. Am I missing? Is there not left to right wind up there? She's basically in here. Obviously not. Well, that worked out nice. My well, last hole was in the wind. How's this not left to right? Yeah, we went southwesterly, which is basically mostly in here. Well, obviously it depends on how you slide it, but you know, obviously we. This could be not enough, huh? Correct. My point is, with that off the slide upslope, we've That's, got to we've got to hit enough. Worry about that too. Yeah. That full video can be found right now on PGATour.com. All right, that'll do it for this week's takeaway, but remember to tune in right here for Trending on Tour on Tuesday.